What's going on YouTube? This is Sehaman back with another Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles figure review. Based off of the Nickelodeon cartoon, we're going to be taking a look at Shredder, deadly leader of the evil Foot Clan. Now this is pretty much, uh, this is like the Comic Con exclusive, but not as metallic. Um, I do have the Comic Con exclusive, and the, the Comic Con exclusive is a lot better than this one. It's, it's way, it's, it's totally metallic. This one isn't. This is going to be plastic. This is the retail version of the Comic Con. So if you guys didn't get the Comic Con version, here's a chance to get the Shredder with the mask off. Now the packaging is exactly the same as all the other Power. Uh, I'm sorry, I was going to say Power Rangers, as all the other Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle figures that we've seen. We've got the images right there of the turtles, and the back of the packaging here. We got a nice image there of Shredder with his mask off from the animated series. A little read up if you guys want to read that, feel free and uh, read ahead. And right there on the bottom are the other s figures that complete the series. You can see all that right there and I think I've pretty much reviewed all of these already. But that's the back of the packaging. So let's go ahead and take Shredder outside of packaging, guys. We're going to take a closer look, so stay tuned. And here we go. Here's a quick little 360 look at the Shredder figure right here, which is pretty cool. You get a little close-up right there. You get a quick little top-to-bottom look at the actual figure himself. Very, very nice. Really like the way the head sculpt came out on this. Quick top-to-bottom. Now we're going to take a closer detailed look at Shredder. Okay, so this guy did not come with any accessories. He is a lot different uh, compared to the first Shredder that we got. But you can see he does have his helmet. This is pretty much the only accessory that he does come with. And there's not really much detail, but it looks really cool. I really like the way it looks. So there's a little 360 on that. And you can slide it on Shredder's head. Which looks good. I really like the way this looks. But I mean, the whole point of this figure is to display him without the... Uh, the helmet so you can just take that off and get a close look at the head sculpt here so you can see he's kind of uh, kind of deformed there he's got one side which is kind of like pink and he's got a little bit on the forehead as well you can see he's got a little bit of red underlining under the white under the right eye which is uh, all white you can see right there he's got a middle little angry face going on right there head sculpt looks pretty cool it looks a little a uh, little sick looking but it's pretty nice. Um, the body itself on the figure is almost the same as the first release shredder that we got right here. And if you look at the head sculpts on them, uh, the one on the right has both eyes white when this one doesn't. And this one actually comes with a cape, which also pegs into the back. You just put this over his uh, shoulders here. And you peg this in his back. It was actually easier doing the first time and the cape it actually the figure looks really good with the with the cape displayed and you can see the capes all tore up here on the bottom it's a soft material but it looks really really good on the figure now this one did not come with a cape the one on the right but still I mean this looks great I mean the, the armor on this on this one is on the left is a lot different you can see it on the chest armor where the differences is and the little uh, detail right there on the belt is different than the one on the right you can see the color differences and they can make out the colors on the silver and this one's like a purple color right there so that's um a few things that are different and the armor on the blades on the wrist are a lot longer on the left than the one on the right so there is a there's a there is a, a big difference on each um of these figures even right here on the shoulder armors and uh, let's see about the legs. The legs as well. The armor on the leg, the paint is different. And uh, the armor just seems to be a lot bigger on the new released Shredder. Uh, personally, I like the one on the left. I think the one on the left looks a lot better than the one on the right. Not knocking it. They're both great figures. Um, let's get a look at the articulation here. So the head can rotate side to side. The arms can go in and out, forward and back. He's got a bend at the bicep. Does he have a bend at the bicep? Actually, he doesn't have a bend at the bicep, but he's got rotation at the wrist. The shoulder pads can go up and down. The arm on the right can go in and out, forward and back. He's already got a, he's got like a pre-posed bicep or bend at the arm, so you can't have any arm articulation there, but the wrist can rotate. He's got waist articulation. The legs do go in and out, forward and back. He's got a little bend at the knee. Uh, not really any rotation at the leg. 
and uh, the one on the right also has a little bit of bend on the knee but you can't really straighten the knees out or the leg out on the right too much because of the um, the little armor that he has on the right knee or right lower leg but overall man this figure actually looks really cool and again it's a lot different from the first release there's a lot of differences so you're gonna want to pick this up it's not just it's not really just a repaint I mean you're gonna want it this one to display with a mask on and this one to display with the the mask off and again there's a few little paint differences the armor is a lot different and the cool thing is he does come with a cape let's get a close up on the head sculpt one more time before we uh, finish off this video all right guys this is Seha man hope you guys enjoyed this review we're taking a look at the uh, Nickelodeon Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles this is the second release this is like shredder part two taking a look at shredder hope you guys enjoyed this review stay tuned got a lot more on the way thanks guys